hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so today we want to learn how to print from revit to pdf so for this you need to use windows 10 and above yes because it comes with features of you printing to pdf so that's what we want to take advantage of so on this file i have a list of drawings i've created sheets you can watch my other youtube videos on how to create sheets so uh, i want to show you i have a list of uh works i've done on panel already it's already in panel this is just the three bedroom bungalow all right so we'll go straight to that so with that you can go to file print or you just press ctrl p so once you do that you come down here you see microsoft prints to pdf all right you go to the properties advanced just a simple method i would like to print it on a3 paper so i'll say okay okay so now you can actually print for rent view only so but i want to print a set of this whole sheet here created so I'll go to select then when you go to that you go to set that you select views and sheets then you go to select uh let me make you can actually create sets let me delete all these sets so start from afresh all right so for you to do that you have, you have to select set so for you to select like you can see it's in views and sheets or you can hide the view so it's, you only have sheets you just highlight all everything you want then just click one then you can actually deselect anyone you don't want to show but let's assume I want everything to show. So you say save. You can save as whatever name you want to name. You can say set one, set two, or whatever name you want to give it to it. All right. So with that, you said okay. Now you have the option of creating combined multiple selected views and sheets in a single file. Yes. So we have about twelve or so sheets. What this means is that it will combine all the sheets together and make it one. Yeah. Or if you want it separately, fine, it's all on you. But let's assume I want to combine everything as one, which is better for easy assessment. Then you go to the setup. I prefer using center. Yeah. Then it's already on landscape A3. You said okay. Mm, don't need to save that. You can use that any other time. So with this, you click OK to ask you where you want to save it okay just save it in documents just save it as excuse youtube drawing whatever name you want to save it and file location so it will take some time to save all right guys our drawing has saved to pdf so we'll open it as you can see all the drawings have saved as one pdf file for printing and whatever you want to use it for so i'll just show you a method of printing that i do just a tip all right um i normally use this this is my printer let's change it to a3 okay if you can see as you can see the border is a little much so i normally scale mine to 105 percent so it gives me a nice border for on my paper but you can use 103 or you can just leave it to fit if whatever whatever works for you whatever works for you but i prefer using 105 scaling all right then you can print all that all right all right then. all right guys thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe to my youtube channel make comments and tell me if there's any other thing we need to talk about thank you very much